Hey, welcome back to Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask Combined Randomizer. Hopefully you're one of the people who are, are, is, enjoying this. What? And yeah, not one of those people that's like, Oh, you found everything in the first 20 minutes. We don't like those people. They always got something to say, man, as if I did something wrong. But we do appreciate the time you take to watch the video. So we got our iron boots. Let's check this thing out. Bomb shoes. For which game, I don't know. Majora's Mask. Well, it might come in handy. But alright, let's make our way to the Gerudo region. Because we got a couple keys for the training grounds and we have the membership card. Still no Epona's song. Oh, no Song of Storms for that matter, too. And no hammer. Man, we can't do anything over here. Good thing the long shot works. Alright, in Zora's River we found the membership card, so this will be pretty easy. We don't have to worry about sneaking around. And we do have, I think, one hideout key for saving the carpenters. I don't remember where we got that, but I remember seeing in parentheses, hideout. Oh crap, I don't have 10 rupees. Uh, well alright, let's test the theory with the guards then. Let's see how many keys, I'm pretty sure we have one at least. Yeah, we do, so we could just open this. Oh no, you gotta trigger the guard first. Well, this means they probably do drop all their stuff. But also the ultimate prize is going to be different too because the, the car. I suck at fighting these things. I remember I used to... I don't know if it was this game or Majora's Mask, but I remember I learned a rhythm with Deku Nuts and the bow. Or like the hook shot or something. I can't remember. But there was a way to guarantee a jump slash or something every time. 20 rupees. Alright. Well, now I don't know what I want. Like, at this point in time, it would be nice if the remaining three guards dropped the remaining three keys. But... Being that this is a randomizer, that is highly unlikely. But it's just as well to get three random items. It's just a matter of like, when are we going to see the ultimate item for where the where you would normally get the Gerudo card. Let's see, we got any funny stories? Oh no, I'm a little bit sleepy. Um, we're going to get the Megaton Hammer, man. I f I'm feeling hammer time. Epona's song would be nice. Saria's song would be nice so we could actually get to the forest temple. Or I guess for that matter, we could also get the minuet of forest, which we still don't have. And we could get the back way into the forest. Come on, you stupid. What is that? Snowhead fairy number three. Well, hang out in that cage there, chum. Sucks to be you. Getting some rupees now, though. So we can do the training grounds. I think we have two training ground keys. I didn't write it down anywhere, but I seem to remember two. This is the next day. It is, oh, well, now it's actually the 30th of August. Getting closer to Starfield, man. I can't wait. I gotta call my dad and help him set it up. He doesn't really know how to work the new Xbox interface and how to use the controller to type in stuff. So I gotta help him out, man. This could be something.
Hey, what? that's actually perfect. The third key for the Gerudo training grounds. What a spot to get that. All right, let's see the remaining guards. Oh, this is the final one. The one that I always did last anyway. So wait, there's nine keys in the Gerudo training grounds. Two of them you never have to use. So that's a total of seven. We have three. So we can't get to the main chest, but we can get to a couple of the chests on the left-hand side of that cage. Plus, we can do all of the trials, I'm pretty sure. So yeah, this is this is definitely like where we gotta be right now. Oh wait, maybe it is the bow. Ah, oh, why does it have to be Ocarina of Time? We need a red potion for Majora's Mask, man. We actually need two red potions total. Don't talk crap about total. <laughs> Remember the Tourette's guy? I haven't had total cereal in a while. But actually, some Raisin Bran or something sounds pretty good right now. Every now and then you get those Bran cravings, you know? Alright, what? You can't be doing that! What? Did it break? Oh, come on! Giant's knife. Making a little doink noise. I'll doink you in the face! Come on, man, this ramp is no... All right, there... what is that, another fairy? Number four for a woodfall. That sounded very, uh, Price is Right. Which, speaking of, Bob Barker died. I saw something that they said since he was 99 years old. People were saying he, like, died at the the best number to get. Because you know how, like, at the end you have to spin the wheel and if you go over a hundred or whatever. Or, like, you go over a dollar. Hey, the stone mask! Speaking of the, the Gerudo. That's the Gerudo of the other game. Lots of stone tower fairies. Alright, uh, what do we want to do? Let's check out the maze first. See where these three keys get us. Screw the right side, that's the two you never need. Left side, invisible wall. Why did it say progressive Deku shield? There's nothing beyond that. It progresses into super wood. Kohiro! And this isn't enough to get to the other chests. Nah, we need another key, man. Man, nuts. Hmm, alright, well, the trials. Which way do we go? We don't have the hammer, so we don't want to go to the left. We want to go to the right and loop around. Because that guarantees that we don't need the hammer. Hover boots help out in this room, I think? Oh, this Stalfos is gonna wreck me! Ah, oh, I have fairies. Hey! <laughs> 
They make such weird noises. Well, that was a pretty sloppy fight. I feel like this room and this one right here with the coins in it or whatever. I'm never ready. By the time I get to these two rooms, I'm like, I'm never ready for the training grounds. Maybe I just suck at these two rooms. Oh, here comes Charles. Okay. Indiana Jones moment. Did I tell you about my peach energy drink? Tried a new one. Zero sugar, peachy keen. I think I said that already. I can't remember. I did copy the file because I, uh... <laughs> oh, man. I suck at everything. Yeah, it takes me a little bit sometimes. Like, sometimes I do my whole, like, three, two, one, go thing, and then I start to go, but I realize I'm not ready yet. So I copied the file just in case. Oh, we're gonna have to hear beeping for, like, nine years now. Prozac can make it better. Noise, noise. Any kind will do. Alright. I don't need hearts. Don't think twice. It's alright. Bob Dylan said that. These guys might drop hearts. That's a weird phrase when you think about it. Don't think twice. Like, who counts how many times they think during the day? It's a continuum, man. It's a stream of consciousness. It's not like step one, step two. As much as you would like life to be in steps and stages. Like, I remember that in psychology. There was always, like, the ones... Oh, good, the beeping stopped. An empty bottle of oot. But yeah, there was always the psychologist who thought in stages. And then, like, there was the other group of people. Like, the behaviorists or something who, uh, were like, No, nothing's in stages. It's all a continuum. And then there was the other people being like, No, it's all in stages. And that's pretty much the history of psychology. It's just a bunch of people saying no to each other. Until you get to modern day where they say it's a little bit of everything. A little bit of nature, a little bit of nurture. You have to be a fool to realize, uh... The family you're born into dictates a lot of how you're gonna be. I just look at that people I was mentioning last time where, uh... I was saying the suns don't work. When I became the sun, I shone life into the man's hearts. When I became the sun, I shone life into the man's hearts. System of a down, man. System of a down. Alright, this is a nice trap normally. Hey! Ooh, a frosty red potion for the wrong game again, man. Good thing the treasure still spawned. False key fire. Don't we already have that? Well, we have it now. Yeah, this, this game would be better to play on mod loader, I think. Just for that convenience of being able to hold A down and see how many keys you have for each temple. Project 64 doesn't have that built in. Alright. Scarecrow. I 
I love that you don't actually have to do the song anymore. It's amazing how these games are just like so well designed for these speed ups and stuff. Like Mario randomizers and like Banjo Kazooie randomizer. They're just not as fun. Like, it's got to have this item progression to it. And then you can speed up all the little annoying things. Gerudo Training Grounds! Well, that's pretty much vanilla, then. Because that's what you normally get is the keys for the trials. Alright, well, that gives us access to at least, like, one more chest in the maze. Plus, there's this thing up here. Mask of Truth, we've already had that. I don't mind it, though. If there is a plentiful option that's causing doubles of all these things. I've never played a seed like that before, so yeah, I don't mind it. Oh. Okay, we're good. This is the Megaton Hammer room, but since we came in from the Megaton Hammer door, we don't need it. Why did I say door like that? It like fell out of my mouth like a door falling down. It was like, door. Oh. Hey, hey, now we can actually attempt that trick you can do. Since we can't t dispel the fire. No, there's a way to do this. I've done it in other seeds before. You gotta just mash A like a madman as soon as it clicks on. I know it's doable. Do you need the iron boots? Something about the boots, maybe? I don't know, man. Maybe you can't do it in this one. Oh well. Hopefully it's not anything we need. This room we can do. We have hover boots and the Song of Time. And we can also see what's in the maze without using two keys. The Song of Time might just be my favorite ocarina song. I learned it on bass. Not that it's hard, it's just three notes. Well, and the little like, trickle part. Recovery heart. And what do we got in the two? Zora Tunic, that was like the very first item we picked up. Let's put it on, because we got to do the toilet room anyway. Land title deed. All right, now one of you guys very helpfully said if you press L, you can switch between all the title deeds and stuff. So we should have the swamp one still. So the next time we go to Majora's Mask, I got to remember to press L. But that land one, we could definitely trade in. I don't know which one we're going to use for toilet paper. Because we're... Okay, we're kind of... Uh, hoping to get to Ikana Canyon. Do I got to collect that rupee again? Oh yeah, I do. Because if we could find enough stuff to get to Ikana Canyon, it's possible that we could train in the ocean title deed. Otherwise, that's looking like the best case scenario for toilet paper, which is a sentence, if I've ever heard one.
Anybody have any, like, B-list movies that is, like, one of their favorites? I don't know why, I just got, like, a random memory, like, a random flashback to some stupid movie of, like, it was one of those TV movies or, like, Netflix or something. Where, like, this group of teenagers went hiking in the woods and they got killed by some tribe that lived in the woods. And the ones who survived got, uh, taken in by the tribe. It was just, like, really stupid, and it just made me think, like, there's some really stupid stuff out there that has no purpose. And that movie is one of them. But then again, playing a Zelda randomizer and just being some dude. What purpose does that serve? But why do we have to serve a purpose? It's also weird to think that all living things have hearts. Like little birds running around, they have a little heart in there. The Gibdo mask. Wait, didn't we have that already too? That's that'll trigger the stump. We don't need the Garrow's mask. Listen. I feel like, what, I don't know, it feels like deja vu, like it already happened with the Gibdo mask. I can't remember, though. Oh, nuts! What? Oh, yeah. Man. This place is getting the best of me. Like the Foo Fighters, man. I like how that thing just plonks down there. Big Goron Sword, there we go. Hot dirt. <laughs> the stupid hot dirt story. Um... At the funeral, we were, uh, you know, I was talking to my cousin and my aunt, and they were telling this story about this little kid who named two of their cats, and there's Butters and Hot Dirt. Like, the cat's name is Hot Dirt. And somebody said, uh, they abbreviated it to Dirt or whatever, and the kid was like, no, it's, it's Hot Dirt, <laughs> like, with the, the little twang and everything. I don't know, I guess you had to be there. Well, crud. That wasn't worth it. That was hot dirt. I don't know, you know how you have like those inside jokes? Every family has inside jokes. Hot dirt was kind of like one of those things. It was just a funny story that the family shared. But you gotta tell it right, otherwise people are like, so? That's stupid. Is there a word for that in another language? Like, that feeling when you're mid-sentence or like mid-telling a story and you realize it's not going over well? That like embarrassment that starts creeping up on you? Whatever that feeling is, like there should be a word for that. No, oh, I didn't realize they cut out that cutscene. That's weird. Hey! Navi! What would Saria say if we told her? That we're taking the hobbits to Isengard! Guard, 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 guard. Man, that's like old YouTube days. We're taking the hobbits to Isengard. Wait a minute, we gotta test to see if the bomb chew salesman 
is randomized because I don't know. I didn't make this seed. This guy's like 200 rupees, right? Welcome. That's not how you say welcome. Ah, crud, he's vanilla. What a weird character that, like, has no purpose whatsoever. Alright, the flags. Which are so much easier to see than I remember. I used to have to play the Song of Storms. Just to wait for the lightning flash to see the next flag. I guess the old CRT TVs really, like, it was must have been really blurry. That's probably what it is. It's the difference between the, the actual console versus emulation. All right, here we go. Roll to hook shot. I like how mathematical this game is. What makes it better than all the other ones? Do, 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 do. Oh man, another Squadgy Jr. One of these has a fairy, I'm pretty sure. If memory serves correctly. That neuron's still intact. It's weird to think that there might be a day where that neuron dies and I don't remember. Like, as if one singular neuron is responsible for memory. Wait a minute, what are we doing now, though? We gotta go all the way back. The only other song we have is The Desert. We need some songs. Well, actually, wait a minute. Fire Temple? We've got a couple keys. So we did the Gerudo stuff. That's kind of what my thought process was, was to start with that, see what happened. Because that was definitely the guaranteed one that we could do. But then, uh... We have a little bit of keys for everything. So we could do a little bit of everything. And maybe along the way... From a distance, the stairway, this stairway, it looks like those eagle statues from Lower Norfair in Super Metro. Well, it's not eagle, it's like uh, space pirates or Chozo or something. Well, we have the Fire Temple boss key, but we don't have the hammer, so if we had the hammer, I would beat the dragon right now. Right after this treasure chest. So, if this treasure chest is the hammer, that would be fantastic. Powder keg. Wait, we found the powder keg. The problem is we don't have the Goron's mask. These doubled up items, man. Alright, two keys. That gets us nowhere. Because there's this one, and then there's, like, another one at the end. We could do the side rooms, and that's pretty much it. Because we'll use a key to get to the other end of the bridge, and then that's the elevator platform, and at the top of the elevator is another locked door. So unless we find more keys in here... The black tunic and the silver gauntlets is like tough link. Requiem of spirit, man, what is with these doubled up things? We could use any other song. Oh, that was a long load after that door. 
This is just gonna be a spider because the spiders we know aren't different. why I blocked every single one of those, but okay. Twenty-seven. Hot dirt. <laughs> so stupid. It makes me chuckle because I can hear my cousin saying it and my cousin was making it sound funny. Yeah, I didn't see that cousin for like, I want to say like 10 years or something crazy. He was always like one of my favorite cousins. I had such a good time as a kid hanging out with him. And like nowadays we never see each other. him if he still plays Sonic the Hedgehog because that's where I first played Sonic the Hedgehog was up in his room and he said no he doesn't play any games these days some things you can never get back I guess oh man this was a junk endeavor do I even dare open the door I know there's no point There we go, we did it. There's no point going forward because there's another locked door at the top. I think, anyway. Jabba! Link noises, man. Okay, now what do we do? We got the Requiem of Spirit again. So, I guess. Spirit Temple? Actually, wait a minute, there's some stuff in Desert Colossus. We did the fairy, but we have gauntlets. We can get the scrubs. Get out of here, Lever. You annoying little flies. I will not be defeated by this worm. Small key for Snowhead. Good thing we popped down here. Five Deku Nuts, and I don't want any of that crap. We planted the bean, right? We could ride the bean to destiny. Who said to pick up the rock? Okay. Good. We did plant the bean. Oh, it's just in time for the spider, too. What is that? I didn't see what it was. It looked square and blue. But on the N64, everything is square and blue. Get out of here, you thing! We almost have 30 spiders! That's a check! We gotta get up to 50. You never know, like Saria's song or something could be at 50.
What was that, the silver scale? Oh no. Blue potion for Majora's Mask. Can that count as a red potion, please? It doesn't, but... Man, that would be nice. Alright, we have two keys for the spirit temple. We don't need to open one of the doors. Like the kid side locked doors you can ignore in these randomizers. So if I play this smartly, <laughs> oxymoronic. No, just moronic. But yeah, if I'm wise about the key usage, I should be able to get pretty far in this temple. Great Bay. We have to do Great Bay. I think the pedestal said Great Bay was one of the medallions. We haven't seen the boss remains, really. We got that one twin mold one way back when, and then... Like, it's not just about the medallions. We also need the remains of the bosses. I guess stretched between two games, they could be anywhere. You guys have a favorite bread? Oh, that's a weird question. I tried brioche bread. That was pretty tasty. 29. Hot dirt. Ah, oh, man. Hey, the postman's hat. That's a check. That's something to do in Majora's Mask. Things are looking up. All right, that's one key down, but this key gives us access to a whole lot of rooms. Shay, 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 he said. Yeah, on that Hinge app, since a day has now passed. Hinge and Bumble. A girl named Lindsay and a girl named Catherine supposedly liked me, but I can't do anything about it. Unless I pay like $15 for a membership. But it's fun to have a little fairy tale moment and be like, oh, Lindsay. You ever, like, well, I guess this is a guy thing to do, but, uh, you ever take a girl's first name and put your last name after it just to see what it would sound like if you got married? Hylian Shield Oot, we already have it. All Night Mask, that's another, wait, oh, no. I still don't know what happens if we have to reset the cycle in Majora's Mask. So that's the only danger of that mask. It's gotta be all permanent. The keys, the fairies. In that case, it renders a lot of Majora's Mask useless if they did make a permanence to everything. All right, kid side. Kid side as adult, the randomizer thing that you can do. Got quite
quite a lot of chews. Man, those fruit chew things, what are, what are they called, now and laters? That are so rock hard, but they taste delicious. I haven't had one of those in forever. I have one singular piece of cotton candy bubble gum left. It's like been on my counter for like five years. Probably rock hard now. With no flavor whatsoever. It's funny how, like, when you get older, you just don't care about sugary snacks. That's 30. Hot dirt. All right, enough with the hot dirt thing. Spooky mask. That's... Why is that even in here still? All right. Well, we bypassed a locked door. So there's that. Now... Oh, yeah, I gotta push the thing down. Well. Well, thanks, Scarecrow, for the, the thought. You guys ever think about fruit and vegetables? That's it. That's the end of the sentence. <laughs> I just realized like halfway through how I introduced that sentence, how stupid it sounded. But not like... Fruits and vegetables have to have a superpower to them, right? Like you ever think about... Any kind of ailment you have, like, if you're extra gassy or something, there's got to be a vegetable that you can eat that counters it. Right? Like, everything natural that grows in this world has to be able to, like, remedy bodily things. My buddy Torok in the Discord was telling me to eat three pounds of radishes. <laughs> Show me a bowl of radishes on top of the Wii U. Gotta keep that thing alive, man. Oh yeah, we don't have fire arrows. Well that's all that is for a treasure chest. But yeah, radishes are one of those things that they gotta be a superfood. Every now and then you get like salad cravings, which is I guess your way, your body's way of telling you that like you gotta cut the crap and start gnawing on grass or something. And dogs eat grass and it makes them throw up and like that's just how they keep themselves regular or something. Which makes me wonder why don't we do something like that? I've chewed on grass before, I've swallowed a piece of grass. But I know there's like science behind it and like animals and us have different guts. That's why like dogs can't have chocolate or grapes. Washcloth. Oh, wait a minute. We're staring down a locked door and we have one key left. No, nah, that just goes to the iron knuckle. We can long shot over if we go to the adult side first. So that door can remain locked. And we should be able to use this key on the other side and get a little bit deeper into the temple which is a very good use of our limited two keys that we've had for this place. Basically throwing away 
two. It's like the it's the Gerudo training grounds thing. How there's nine keys, but you don't need two of them. In randomizers, the Spirit Temple has wh however many keys, and you don't need two of them. But yeah, now we need another key for this room. We need the mirror shield to progress much further. I hate when the control stick does little stupid things that make you waste magic. Every little thing she does is magic. Every little thing just turns me on. That's a weird lyric. But it makes perfect sense. Oh, come on, I didn't get the double kill that time. And even though my life is always tragic, now I know my love for her goes on or something like that. Alright. I was on a police kick not too long ago, listening to all kinds of songs by them. Here we go. First try. Good. Stay put. Very good. Yeah, man, we. I, I'm proud of how I used those two keys. Because that gave, gave us access to a lot of stuff. I mean, it's junk. We have, like, bomb shoes galore. And then this cool thing, how you can spawn this chest and then hook shot to the other one. Always feels good to fight those guys. Alright, two chances for something good. Megaton hammer, a song, we need something. Silver scale, that that actually does change well like one thing. Not. That's as far as we can get. We did a little bit of something in a couple places. Spiders? Majora? Postman's hat. Yeah, it does work. Pressing L changes. Oh, so we have three deeds. All right, uh, get your head in the space of Majora's Mask. We're playing something different. We got the postman's hat. What time is it? It's four on the first day. There's still the ranch. Stone Tower small key in the mailbox. All right. All night's mask. Hmm. I don't know what happens if you play the Song of Time. The way I play Majora's Mask is I bleed every cycle as dry as possible. So that's how I'm going to play this. We are going to avoid the Song of Time like the plague. Let's go trade in this deed. Actually, do these guys sell something different, too? Do 
is that green magic? Heart container for 10 rupees. That means that they do sell different stuff. Oh, crap. These... All right, well, th if there's ever a time, we have three of the deeds. Oh. Uh, small key for Ganon's castle. Man. We're actually in a good spot for these very arduous, tedious, not so easy to check Deku scrubs. Man, we could have. If that was a potion for this game, I would have drank it because we need some magic. Blue's good too, you can too. Go to the other deed while we're thinking about it. Oh wait, there's magic in here. Somewhere. Uh, which snowball? It's this one. Alright, I guess we didn't need that green potion after all. This mountain always looks good at sunset. This guy gets the southern swamp. Oh, but he sells only to Gorons, and that's the one thing we can't do. Unless he will also sell it to Link, but I don't think so. I wonder if the Ice Arrows of this game act like Blue Fire. Oh wait, no, they couldn't, because it's hot spring water in this game, not Blue Fire. Yeah, the action slide. All right, buddy, what are you selling? Please don't be something good that we need. Oh, he doesn't even tell you? Heart container. I saw a heart container. Are they all heart containers? Spin attack upgrade. Huh. This is weird. What's up here? Silver rupee. All right, well, we've got if we still can't get to Ikana, but if we do figure out a way. Then, uh, we could trade in the ocean title deed. Got a full wallet. That blue potion is sure nice to look at. It reminds me of that blue marlin drink that I had that was very tasty. Well, so much for the ranch. We have effectively missed out on uh, Romani. A thousand rupees? That wasn't a thousand rupees. Okay, I guess they dumbed it down. Too bad that wasn't anything good. Um... Guru Guru is about to be out. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Before that last chance to do it, it only passes two hours. Like we 
could bleed the cycle dry right now. Oh, to it is. Nuts! What a worthless gesture. 50 rupees for the bank, I guess. Alright, Guru Guru. He's about to be in the laundry pool. Let's go say hi to him. Oh, he is in there, yeah, because two hours passed. Why does that seem almost fitting that he had that? He's not the one who gets it. I guess it would be fitting if the ranch guy gave you that. Alright, so I'm kind of thinking a lot of now what. I just had a thought and it, it left my brain. Like, what was I just thinking? Alright, so this is, for the first time in any randomizer I've ever played, gonna be something different. Deku Nuts. Toilet paper? Since we don't currently have access to Econa Canyon, I hope I don't regret this. But the ocean tidal deed is in the grass in Termina Field, so we can easily get it again. I remember where that one was. Prelude of Light, thank God! It's about time we got that song. Now Ocarina of Time is going to be less of a headache to get in between all the areas. Any chance of, uh... You can't do this at night time. Oh, Tortoise, you suck! Okay. Thank you, Grandma. Okay, we are finally here at the chicken crate that has been haunting me this whole time because I never checked it. It's bomb shoes for this game. And now there's the waterfall as well. And we can plant the magic bean. But we have to loop to Lake Hylia. But we have the silver scale now so we can see what Rudo's letter is. And we can plant the bean in the lake too. Lake Hylia in this game is one of my favorites. I liked it in Twilight Princess too, but... We already had that. We paid money for it. Oh well.
bombs. We have bomb chews and bombs. So these two checks that have been haunting my brain this whole time were pointless. So, so out of the way. But you never know what they're gonna be. I guess we gotta become an adult again. We have 50 bomb juice. Holy crap. Yeah, I don't know. I've got so many items, but... There is stuff we could do as adult Link that we should probably focus on. Okay, this grotto is normally 200 rupees. So much running around to get from place to place, man. It's just dead space. Which means I could cut it all out, which is good. Nuts. All right, well, the spider house. We haven't checked uh, the latest one. All right, we're getting riddled with junk, which means we're bound to get something good soon. I hope. Again, that's probably just gambler's fallacy or something. Uh, actually, we can get another spider. And we never did check Impa's room. Thirty-four. We're all, we're getting closer to forty. go through another dungeon. What is that? Spooky mask again. Let's uh, go light the torches of the grave that we couldn't do before. I just realized I'm not saying anything because all that dead space of walking like from the temple to Kakariko, I was getting used to not saying anything. Let's get our commentary back, man. Sometimes that's easier said than done. What do we got? Man, they must have added a bunch of bomb shoes to the pool or something. Because I've never seen so many bomb shoes before. That is so cool. I love that ice arrow thing. Nuts. Alright, well, Ice Cavern it is. It's the one place that took forever to get to, but... We could do something. And after this, I really don't know for Ocarina of Time. And we're kind of stuck in Majora's Mask. It's really kind of... We need something good, man. So we're kind of, we're just like playing with the same items over and over again. And getting nothing new. Wait, what is that? That is an orange song. 
Could that be Epona? Please be Epona, please be Epona. Yes! Is that for both games? Because that just opened up a whole bunch for Majora's Mask. Let's see what's down here. That's got to be for both games. So it's just a convenience for this one. Well, that's a game changer for Majora's Mask. Crap, now we can actually get to the ocean title deed thing and we used it as toilet paper. This is my favorite room in the ice cavern. I don't know if I've ever said that before or not. It's just cozy. Sonata of Awakening. Did we not already have that? It's a good thing to have. What is this? Song of Soaring. We definitely already had that. I thought it was the lullaby at first. 35. And there's 36 out here. Garbage. Nothing but garbage. Alright, Ice Cavern's done. What are the last final two items here? Garbage. Oh, letter to mama. Okay, that's something. More bomb juice. This front time for Majora's Mask. All right, let's go fishing. Um... I think the worst of the travel time is behind us now. We haven't had any convenient warp songs, so it's just been a, a slog to get here and there. And Ice Cavern is always just kind of whatever. But alright. Taking it easy. I have fish sticks in my freezer from before I went to the funeral. But I checked the ketchup in the fridge and the ketchup's expired and I forgot to buy new ketchup. I was just at the store and I forgot. But tomorrow the sales change at my local grocery store so I'll check it out there. We always talk about fish whenever we come here. I'm always talking about food whenever we're just chilling at the pond. I could go for some pizza, man. The whole time I was in New Jersey, I didn't have pizza. I had a bagel, though, and the bagel was very good. Because New Jersey bagels, if you know, you know, man, they're, they're special. Perfect. All right. That worked out well. We'll see what that is. I don't know how the logic expects things to go, but all right, we got 38 spiders getting closer. Uh. 
garbage. I get the logic expects garbage, I guess. Water temple it is. I don't know how many keys we have for this place, but I think we have a couple. We may have the boss key. Don't remember that either. I appreciate the cutout cutscenes. These like little small ones that were never there before. We only have one key. You know what one of my biggest fears is? Like, I've got the rest of this year planned out with videos. But I don't know what I'm going to do in 2024. And it's my fear that I'm going to run into, like, this point where I don't have any videos to do. And I know I could always do randomizers until they're dead. But my counselor always says this, it's like the life of an artist. There's ups and downs. But it's just scary to think that... Like, I mean, I guess it's no different than if you get laid off at a job. You can't really predict when that happens. Golden skill, well, the only use for that we already did. But yeah, as far as like my academic track and like a typical career, that stuff's come to a standstill. I basically quit that whole track of life in favor of this YouTube stuff. So if this YouTube stuff ever hits a wall, oot shoot indeed. I guess that puts even more pressure on finding a spouse. Because as long as you got a partner, maybe there's a way to work through things together. But the problem is, at this age, your career means a lot. Squadgy Jr. Like, your career is also, like, how you sell yourself to potential spouses. I just want it all to be okay, man. That's all I want. I want somebody to see what I do and think it's neat and not have a problem with it. And then I won't have a problem with it. And then we'll just carry on. One of the profiles that, and when I was like swiping through that app, there was a girl in there that was like, I forget what the question prompt was, but she was like, I think it might've been like, you'll win me over if, and then she wrote, you have no problem like quitting our jobs every summer and going like backpacking or something. I was like, oh, geez. What happened? Oh, the boots are still on. Crap. Oh, we almost didn't make it. I forgot the Furore's wind. The Minuet of Forest, yes! Finally something new! An Epona song, we still have the huge change that Epona song brings. The Water Temple is being good to us. So that's Forest Temple now too. And that's a check because she, the Minuet of Forest itself. The back entrance in, so we don't have Saria's song, but we got the back entrance one. Which is arguably better. Although Saria's song has two additional checks tied to it, too. Hey. 
This is just for a spider, so that's eh, whatever. So back to the real topics at hand. Uh, what was I last saying? Just how I want everything to be okay. I mean, like, who doesn't? Oh, yeah, that backpacking thing was kind of interesting. I would like to learn something from the next girl I date. Whether it be another skill or another language or something. Like, that would be kind of cool. Because a part of me is not content with the idea that um, all traditional form of growth has become stagnant. Like without further schooling and uh, without a standard job, everything is at a standstill. Where is that torch? I think it's by the torches. Yeah, it must be. I just know, do not open this door. What the heck? I thought it was... Is it by the carpet? Ah, the carpet is the answer, okay. Alright, so that bypasses a key in this temple. And we can do the second floor stuff. Because we have the long shot already. Plus, the compass doesn't, you don't need anything. You guys checking out the watchdogs videos that are going out hey the great fairy mask i wasn't even thinking about that thing that changes like that makes all the temples i'm very curious to see what that's gonna be like the fact that we're finding the stray fairies in all these other locations that means the stray fairies are all gonna be different items which is gonna be really interesting to see That could be where a lot of the keys for this game are. Yeah, I don't mind doing this puzzle twice. It's a little bit annoying, I guess, but... Has ever actually like look up the dungeon music of Zelda games? It's like I like the Water Temple music, but I don't think about it all the time. Like when I think of songs from video games, I think of like the peppy ones. So I'm never like, I guess if I was studying or something like. Zelda dungeon music would be good background noise for studying or something. But it's not really like active listening music. Alright. 
This is why you can bypass that key down there. Thanks to the long shot. It's neat the different ways you can play through these temples and randomizers. That's 40. That's another check. So at this rate, I just want to get the next 10 and get 50. Huh? What? Dang it, man. <laughs> that was ridiculous. And other such whistles and tunes. Man, I'm bummed out. I fell asleep before. And uh, from like 7 to 8, there was a speed dating thing on Bumble. And I wanted to check it out because like what it is, is uh, it's only text conversations. And if you hit it off, then I guess at the end of it, you get to see the pictures of the person on their profile. Which is a neat thing in concept. I wonder, like, the research behind that, if it works. I've never done a speed dating thing before. But I figured I'd check it out, because, like, what the heck? You've got the safety of, like, hiding behind your phone screen. But yeah, I fell asleep during the hours in which it was going on, and then by the time I clicked the notification on my phone, it was like, it's not happening till Thursday. I was like, shut up. Woodfall. Almost have all the fairies. Kind of. Also kind of, not really. I wonder how they recorded the swimming sound. Because it doesn't sound like water. You ever think they recorded something like inappropriate to get a sound? It's like nobody ever knows what they're listening to. It kind of sounds like mouthwash. I don't know, my brain goes all over the place, dude. But well, you know the like squeezable jelly stuff? If you squeeze it back and forth a whole lot, the sound that it makes sounds very inappropriate. So like, if you were to listen to a sound that sounded inappropriate, it could just be that they were squeezing jelly. And there you go. One of the random facts of life. Do you guys like grape jelly or strawberry jelly? Or maybe you enjoy both because you're so cool that nothing bothers you. I prefer grape jelly, but I don't mind the strawberry really. If I had it, if I had to, I've eaten it before. boss key for this temple? I can't remember. Could 
Because we can't go to Dark Link. We need two keys at least to get to Dark Link. We can get the spider. Yeah, we got 41 spiders and it's something. Ah, I got nothing. I thought I had a jingle, but I did not. Let's see if we have the water temple key or not. I have no idea. Two hop. Uh oh. Uh oh. Wait, no, this might be perfect then. Squeeze it out, Link. Mm. Please, 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 please. Yes! We have it! I don't remember where we got it, but we have it. All right, here we go, B-52s. Just go nuts. Ah, 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 down, down. All right, this is B-52s, man. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know. Time keeps on ticking. This is a cool animation if you really think about it. Is it a hexagon or an octagon? Either way, it goes gabloop. And it's the fire medallion. Does that set Kakariko on? No, we don't have forest yet. Karako. Karako. It reminds me of my one friend. He started randomly saying cucumber weird. He would say cucumber. For no reason. It's actually kind of funny. The oh, Wow, they got rid of that cutscene? Wait, did they get rid of the sunrise? Well, you can't do that. Now I can't check the lake. Speaking of stupid things that people do. Hmm. Well, wait, we got the Minuet of Forest in there. Uh. Sing a song happily. Take you to the wooded tree. I don't know. And we get 50 rupees. Well, I did say we were doing a little bit of everything, didn't I? Here we go again. Half of a temple. <laughs> Two keys. That's hardly enough for this place. This place is ridiculous with its keys. Like, all the locked doors in this place are perfectly positioned to be a nuisance. If you don't have the keys. I guess because there's a lot of dead space in between the doors or something. So it just takes a long time if you get somewhere without the key. Man, we have like five shields at this point. I've been starting to get those Hello Fresh emails again. They went away for a while and I was like, good riddance. But now they're sending them again. 
So they must be doing some kind of promotional thing. I do have to join back up or try one of the other ones. Because I just eat peanut butter and jelly for a living, man. And you can't be doing that, especially if I enter the dating scene. Girl asking me questions and I'm like, yeah, I eat peanut butter and jelly. She'd be like, can you make food for the children that I have? Let me eat peanut butter and jelly. Peanut butter and jelly and beefaroni. And lots of naps. Breed skinny fat. I like that fairy's face. We gotta get it together, man. It's just the YouTube lifestyle, it's sucking me in. Don't say the next thought. But I want to, no. I don't know, maybe the online dating thing doesn't work. Maybe you gotta, uh, go somewhere and meet people. We almost have all of the Stone Tower Fairies. Listen, guy with the perfect accuracy. Well, that couldn't have been any slower. Thank you. Oh, well, I didn't just save that for later. I guess you gotta do the Song of Time block regardless. Let's see, two keys I think gets us... ...to the Twisted Corridor, but then we're probably stuck. So we could do, like, up to the block puzzle, and that's about it. Hop! More of that B-52 stuff. You know I'm afraid to go to conventions because of cosplaying. Gerudo Training Grounds, that actually might give us access to some treasure. I can't remember if we were one door away from another chest or not. Yeah, but you might be wondering how the heck are you afraid of cosplaying? I, I'm not afraid of cosplaying. Because that's weird. But it's just the girls end up looking so good, man. And you have to behave yourself. Which is very easy to do. Just look, but don't touch. I don't know why people have trouble with that rule. But, like, nobody wants to be that guy that... ends up, like, hitting on a girl or whatever, or trying to flirt with her. Like some loser. Just because she's dressed up like... Chun Li or something. So I already know if I went to conventions, I would not talk to anybody. I would just sit there like all bottled up in my own little world. And I would probably get depressed the more hot people I saw. Because that's what happens in my life. I see attractive women and I get more and more depressed. Because, like, I can't do anything about it. I don't know, it's so stupid. I wish that wasn't the way that things were, but I'm not joking, that happens. Well, like, the, the very first neuron that fires is like, oh yeah, look at her. But then it's immediately shot down by other electric brain movements. So it's like, oh yeah, oh no! That's basically what it goes. 
You see a hot girl, and the brain goes, oh yeah, oh no. And then you start crying, and no, you don't start crying, but basically, the insides of your body are crying, whether or not you actually do cry. And we call that desperation and loneliness. There it is! Red potion for Majora's Mask! We might not have a life, but we got life now. Man. Alright, so where, where, where did we leave off on the clock in that game? What a spot for the red potion, dude. We gotta... We gotta not waste this crap. Unless they really did do, like, a forever change for Majora's Mask where your stuff doesn't get deleted, but... That seems like a lot of stuff you have to edit. I got an email from Microsoft saying that they're having trouble authorizing my card for my Starfield purchase. And I don't know if it's the one for myself or the one that I did for my dad. Because, like, I could understand if I purchased it for myself and they said, okay. And then I purchased it for my dad, and they were like, wait a second, why is the same card on two accounts? I could see how they would reject the second payment. So maybe that's what it is, but I gotta look into it. So if we twist the hallway, we can get the treasure that's down below. And that's about all we can do, because there's another locked door right away. <laughs> Nocturne of Shadow! Holy crap, was that a smart decision to flip the hallway. We're playing this well, man, with, like, the keys and stuff. That spirit temple business, and then, uh... That just now, it just feels like... Utilizing strategy with the keys. A limited amount of keys. Speaking of cosplays, listen, man, with your green hand. Okay, turn back to normal now, please. I don't know, what's the best cosplay you've ever seen? Like, there's those crazy ones where they dress up as Samus in the suit. Samus, whatever her name is. Not just the Zero suit, I mean, like, the whole armor and everything. Those ones are probably the craziest, because you gotta build this giant costume. Hey! I like the ones that dress up as Cammy from Street Fighter. And I don't think I need to tell you why. Alright, well, we're stuck. But, we beautifully got a song. I'm in a bad spot right now, man. Bah, what the heck, let's just do it. No, but like... Mentally, I think I'm in a danger zone. We have a lot of keys for the Shadow Temple, I think. I don't know about the boss key, though. 
I want to say we do. Four keys. Yeah, that's a lot for this temple. That might be all of them. No, nothing's at a measly four. Everything's like five or something. This really is a little bit of everything. Nah, but I gotta chill out, man. I'm not doing anything wrong at all, but I'm talking like an idiot. With all this dating stuff. But that's what they say. It's like the cartoons, man. When, like, a hot nurse walks past a dog and the dog's eyes bulge out and his tongue's hanging out. Like, that, that's the state of my mind right now. And it makes you say things that... are very much along the lines of desperation. Lullaby intro. Why is it the intro and not just the lullaby? Do we have to actually see the baby? It might be a progressive thing, but that's... That's a weird thing to be progressive. Yeah, but it's true, man. When you're, uh... When you're lonely... It's hard to focus on, like, being happy and concentrate on what you have to concentrate on because the loneliness hurts so bad. And similarly, when you're, like... We already had that. When you're like the cartoon dogs with their eyes bulging out and your tongue hanging out and you're just like insatiable. You can't concentrate that on like what you have to concentrate on then either. But not because you're miserable, it's because you're just going out of your mind crazy. I feel like this is a weird thing to talk about. I'm probably going to regret saying half of the stuff I just said. But those who know... know. Hey. Why is it always gamers, though? Why are gamers the ones that have trouble with love? Is it because it's like a hobby closely linked to autism or something? We already had that too. This is getting stupid. I don't know. Maybe it's just easy to like... Think of a why me situation. Like maybe it's not really gamers. It could be anybody. But like they always make jokes about it. Like Family Guy said, a bottle of red potion for Majora's Mask. Wait, does that give us two? That's Shiro and the Witch. That's the two potions that we need, if that's the case. Yeah. 
This is a very tight needle or whatever. Like if resetting the cycle really is as dangerous as it feels, we've got like all the right pieces. To not screw up. Does anybody else get irrationally, or maybe not so irrationally, afraid of chopping off their fingers whenever you use a sharp knife? Especially if the thing you're cutting takes a lot of effort to actually cut. I don't know, I, I have very little experience with food preparation and stuff, so I'm not good with a knife. One time I sliced my finger cutting a bagel and I had to call my mom at work and I was crying. And she thought I chopped my finger off and she actually like left work early to come because she thought she had to take me to the hospital. But it was just like a little like butter knife cut. <laughs> but if you can cut yourself with a butter knife, that just goes to show you how vicious I butter things. Hey! My last girlfriend made fun of the way that I knifed the butter. She's like, I can always tell when you go in the butter because it's just, it looks like you stabbed it to death. And then she tried to teach me how to butter smoothly. And I never really got it. It's like holding a pencil. I've always held a pencil with like all my might. I like how this room is kind of fast now, thanks to the block pushing being sped up. It's nice that this crossover thing has all of the nice speed ups of the individual randomizers. sound outside. I wonder if that's going to get picked up. Spirit Temple Key! That'll get us further in there. But not quite all the way. I think we still need a couple keys. Boss key for the forest temple. Well, that doesn't matter until we get more small keys. Bottle of Lon Lon milk. I think we have all the Ocarina of Time bottles. so this will be easy. That platform's really not too hard to guess where it is without the lens. You just gotta like remember to wait a little bit and run at a certain angle. We can really get deep in this temple. I think we're gonna be like one key short. Which 
really sucks, because that takes us to the bitter end for nothing. So really, at this point, we gotta hope for another Shadow Temple key. And if everything's doubled up... Okay, 7th Great Bay Fairy. See the benefit of like doing Ocarina of Time first though? You just go into Majora's Mask with like all the stuff. We almost have 50 Skulltulas. We might actually be able to get it. I think like there's the boat one. There might be. There might be another one by the triple skull pot. I can't remember right now. man sitting in one spot for too long it's just the fans on oh, no, I never realized the fans faces look like old-school Ganon Pig Ganon. Am I not straight? Oh, I saw it, but I didn't do anything about it. Now we gotta... See, try to go fast, and you end up going slower. having trouble with the side hops, but... What? GameCube D-pad, man. It thinks you press all kinds of directions. Fire Temple? That's more we can do that? Well, a little bit more we could do. We haven't seen much about the Fire Temple, so that was a good find. We really need a lot of- we gotta get to Majora's Mask and start doing the fairies. So that's where the keys are gonna be. Red Potion for Oot. We don't need that. But yeah, there's the Majora's Mask stuff. After having done all these dungeons, we're like exhausting Ocarina of Time's possibilities, and there's a lot we could do in Majora's Mask now. Hey, the big bomb bag. I'll take it. Even though we keep getting bombs like every other pickup, so it doesn't really matter. Alright, here's the boat. This will get us another spider. We'll be like one away from 50. What are the chances we're gonna find a small key? Because, uh... The doorway to the boss is locked. I think we have the boss key, but not the one small key that we need to get to the boss door. So it really is everything except for that final room.
This boat used to scare me when I was a kid. Just that shot of the head going up and down. And then like entering the doom tunnel. I guess that's what it was supposed to do. It's like a phantom boat thing. It's supposed to be scary in the shadow temple. What did he land on? He was still alive. I didn't know there was platforms that had a collision detection down there. Yeah, there it is, the locked door, that's the problem. Right there. There's still hope. There might be a small key in one of these rooms. It's really grabbing for straws at this point, but... Alright, Din's fire. We have a nice mix of bottled contents. Garbage. And... Snowhead. Three keys for Snowhead. I don't remember how many keys are. I want to say three is probably pretty good. Because you can skip a key, a locked door in Snowhead too. You don't have to open. So one of those keys is useless. Which means you get plus one key for where it matters. And this is 50. There we go, the spiders are done. We just gotta get those last two checks. And I believe these three pots are nothing, but I always forget, so I'm gonna do them anyway. Magic. More magic, and then the rupee one, right? Okay, so try to remember for next time that the triple pots is useless. There have been a few times that I've passed it by and said that's useless. Last chance, man. Oh, we did get all three. I thought we only got two there. Come on, small key. I think we have the boss key, so we just need a small key. Yes. No, it's Snowhead. Well, four keys for Snowhead, that makes that temple doable, I think. I saw the small key in the S and was like, yeah! All 
All right. Well. Oh, wait, no, hold on. Let's do the spider checks before we abandon this game. I can't believe we did that whole dungeon except for the final room. Yeah, we are chugging along, man. What do we still need? Saria's song? Um, well, fire and light arrows. Junk. And junk, man, they were all junk. Actually, Woody may have specified that those guys be junk. I don't know. All right, now let's get to Majora's Mask and see what we can do with... We got a lot. We got to check it out. We have two red potions, man. We got the priority mail. Oh, man, we got the great fairy's mask. The graphics are glitching out. We have Epona's song. That's the big thing that we got. God, that was terrible on the eyes. Uh, wait a second. Since we're going places, we actually need rupees. I was going to deposit the rupees, but we got shops to check. All right, Epona, unlock this game for us. Just a little bit too late, though, for the Romani check. Not horse. There we go. Let's start with the thing that we could have done first this whole time. Whoa. Didn't mean to do that. We have the Sonata of Awakening. We've had it. We have the Gibdo Mask. We have the Hook Shot. We have a red potion for Shiro. Like, this is crazy what we can do over here. Here you go, sir. Very hard fought potion, or a hard earned potion, I should say. Oh, you're garbage. Man, imagine if that was something good, though. That's a nice mask you're wearing, yes. Give us the hookshot target. Don't have to do any kind of crazy glitches. I don't know how to do them on the N64 version anyway. And it's been years since I played the 3DS version, but I know it was easier on there. At least until an update. Oh, we don't have the captain's hat. That's another check. That's the girls in West Clocktown. 
Which actually there's Camaro himself too, but we don't have the Song of Healing. Alright, buddy. Uh think the monkey. There it is. I knew I'd find it eventually. Oh yeah, we got the spin attack upgrade. I don't like this. Like, this makes Majora's Mask fun. Wait, that was faster. Oh. Oh, that was nice. Cutting out the crap. Biggest quiver, alright. But yeah, it's almost like starting Majora's Mask with everything. It makes it kind of fun to speed through. As opposed to the individual randomizer where you kind of have to... You kind of have to go through the slog part in the beginning. Just goes to show you how few items are actually in Majora's Mask, though, that actually have power. Oh, uh, we just missed the stupid ocean title deed, the toilet paper. Ah, well. It took forever to deal with those Octoroks and get up here. I'm gonna just cut that out. So what time is it now? Two? Oh, going for three, actually. Alright, uh... Ancient Castle of Ikana! Although... The powder keg, we need the Goron mask for. And we don't have light arrows, so we can't do the bypass. So really, what can we do here? We don't have light arrows, we don't have fire arrows. So we can't get the well check. I think we're here a little too early. We can make things dance, but... There's not much in the way of treasure in here, either. So let's focus on the red potion. Yeah, I think this will be... ...wise. Get the red potion checks out of the way, since who knows if we're ever going to find them again. Oh wait, I don't remember the... The maze. Well, I never know the maze after day one. Oh wait, it is still day one. It's just nighttime. Uh, I still don't remember it though at the current moment. Let's just get the monkey. It might come to me halfway through. It's right, it starts with right, doesn't it? Or no, left. 
Left, right. Right, straight, left, left. Yeah, I think that is it. Beautiful. Another hard-earned check. You know, the clock doesn't actually move that fast, though. So if you do use my strategy of doing Ocarina of Time first, mostly. Scoop some water for the bean. Um, it's really not that time crunch scary to do all these checks. Then again, if the only red potions for this game were like Deep in Stone Tower or something, that would suck. Oh yes, we got a bathroom break and get a new drink break. Also, what do we get for this? Ten bombs. Okay. That's right, we couldn't get the magic bean from the shop because we gotta talk to this guy first. So does that mean that he's still a magic bean? Yes, it does. Okay, very good, so we can check the monkey. We've got a good hold on this thing right now. It feels like we're at least halfway done. It could just be because there's so much in Majora's Mask that we can now do. Like Pirate's Fortress is gonna be littered with stuff. When you think about how many chests are in there. But we gotta get through this slog of a place first. You know what I really hope I don't have to do though? The spider houses of this game? If there really is two of everything, we shouldn't have to. Priority mail has two recipients. How, how does that work? Where, we got the priority mail from a singular check in Ocarina of Time that we can't get again. So... Did they just make the priority mail infinite? My bubble with your nut. It's like burping while eating a walnut. I haven't had a good walnut in a while. Wait, what's over here? The piece of heart is... 
the Picto box, it looks like. Do we need that? We might. Oh wait, I gotta get in the flower. Ah, dang it. I missed this cycle. <laughs> well, we've come this far. We gotta do the monkey first. As tempting as it is to grab that Picto box right now. And this kicks us out too, so we can't just simply go back and grab it. I don't want to do all the sneaking for it. Couples mask! We already had that! We already checked it! Alright, Woodfall it is, I guess. We know where the Picta box is. Let's pretend it doesn't matter. If we have to come back for it when, at a moment when we're really stuck or something, we will. But I'd rather press on right now. Dawn of the second day, we have officially missed out on the ranch. But we are doing Andrew Caffey stuff. Oh wait, no we're not. Cause we didn't actually mail the letter. If we don't get that letter soon, the mailman's gonna do his rounds and he's not gonna pick it up. So he's gonna, not gonna have anything to deliver and that ruins all the rest of the Andrew Caffey stuff. Which is why randomizing that stuff sucks. But I guess we'll deal with it. Yeah, Deku Link for Smash, man! It doesn't make sense to me that they didn't add. I guess it's just too much work to add that many characters. But if they did it with the Pokemon Trainer, they could have easily done it with Young Link on Smash Bros. Alright, we got a quick warp back. I guess we'll get the remaining treasures first and then trigger the temple. Fire Temple Key. There's some progress to be made there. There's such a good move set for Deku Link. Flowers is up B, down B is the Deku nut, B is the bubble. Hmm, okay. One more chance. For something, anyway. And then we got a whole temple and we get to see what the stray fairies look like. Postman's hat number two. Yeah, the doubling up of items is both nice and kind of a letdown. Beep, 
boop, 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 boop. All right, I'm assuming it just, yep, yeah, put it there. We need some magic. All right, what do the stray fairies look like? A Deku stick? Does it float to me the way a flary does? A flary? A fairy does? Yes, it does! Well, that's interesting. Milk for Majora's Mask. This should be pretty quick and easy. We got the bow, we got the bunny hood, we got transformation masks. I like this stray fairy thing, actually. It makes this the most interesting Majora's Mask randomizer. Ooh, Captain's Hat, speaking of! Well, it's daytime now, we gotta wait till nighttime day two. Yeah, this makes the dungeons way more interesting in this game compared to the randomizers I've always done. I kind of like it. Bremen mask. It's going to get stuck on the block, isn't it? Yeah, it can't come to me. It's having some troubles. Oh well, we'll get it in a second. There it is, Bremen mask. That's a check for the ranch that we missed. That's the room key. Coming at us. What is that? What, what's happening? What is that? Bombs? Or was that the fierce deity's mask? I just saw like something squarish and blue. Oh, it is bombs. Okay. <laughs> The bombs just seeking Link out. Oh wait, we gotta check that compass room. Cause it could be something. We'll get it on the return trip. Since we don't have to press forward, since we already have the bow, we're not going to the horrible room of this dungeon. Yeah, he said quite a number of times. what I was looking for. Ah, junk. What a waste. Alright, let's check that compass before we forget. Oh, 
Oh, yeah. You, like, never come in this room. for the well. Ugh, I hope we don't have to go to that place. I really hate the well. We need fire arrows and then we can just screw the well. The well matters not at all. Oh wait, there is uh, there is a 50 rupee chest in the well. And a 20 rupee chest, I think. Had that too. Wait, where are the locked doors in the well? Oh, it's the bottom of the well, not the well of this game. like playing Majora's Mask, so I'm thinking of the well in this game, and, uh, yeah. This room is a little bit slow for my liking, but... There's a diner in Atlanta that has a really good dessert selection. And I really could go for a slice of key lime pie right now. It was a big slice that I shared with my ex-girlfriend at the time. Well, she was my girlfriend at the time. Now she's my ex. We still talk to each other though, which maybe is not a smart decision, I don't know. Come on, let me go, let me go. Oh, well, you're gonna make me miss the platform cycle. Of all the cutscenes they skip, they leave that one in there. Not a fan of this frog boss either. bombs instead of the Deku mask, right? It's just been so long. As Nintendo Capri Sun says, so long, Cletus. So long. I don't know what that's from. It's from something. have the Don Jero's mask. I don't know if we need to check those frogs, but we might as well while we're here get them set up. 
New Wave Bossa Nova, that's a good find. So now Great Bay is doable. We have some small keys for it too. I want to say we have the boss key for Great Bay as well. I really should be writing this stuff down or using a tracker. I don't, know, I don't like the trackers on screen though. It's too much clutter. Your brain is the tracker. Yeah, nuts. What has been your favorite decade to live so far? Did you like zero to 10? Another well key. Zero to 10, 10 to 20, or 20 to 30, or if you're older than that, 30 to 40, or how's 40 to 50 going? I don't know what I liked best. I guess they've all had their ups and downs. I think I need to keep that mask on. Yeah, because that's right, it spawns the chest. And it's actually easier to do when the torch isn't on fire because you don't run the risk of burning Deku Link. Double defense? Is that for both games? Or just this one? We would be doing this one day. Both games combined into one. Oh, is that Saria's song? It's green. Song of Healing. That's Darmani. And my cow. There's Epona's song again. Goron Tunic. So we bought our first one, but there was the legitimate one, I guess. Bossanova. It kind of looked like the Nocturne of Shadow for a second in the bubble. That's weird. The Bossanova's two locations were right here. Wait, do we have the boss key for this dungeon? There's no way of knowing. We're not tracking anything and we didn't write anything down, I don't remember. 
All we can do is cross our fingers. Please tell me I have the key. Ah! <laughs> no! Stupid key sanity, man. All right, well, it is possible to find a Dolwa's remains and get back here really fast. So we only have six of the fairies. We got the bossa nova. We we've got a lot of stuff to do. I don't know what about the lullaby intro though. I don't know what's up with that. So yeah, there's a lot to do this cycle still. But we should probably think about ending things off. Because uh we're gonna be playing for a long time if if I get carried away here. And we've already been playing for a long time. So I guess the next destination will be Epona to Great Bay, or we could briefly check the lullaby intro with the baby. Oh no, it doesn't. We don't have to. We don't have Goron mask. Oh wow, it saves it like Ocarina of Time. That's weird. Save the game and keep playing. Okay. All right. Well, thanks for watching, you guys. Enjoy Clock Town Day 2, and I will see you uh, next time. We might finish it. I don't know. But yeah, take care.